and welcome to another edition of Drew's Food Reviews. Today, I've got another edition of Candyland. Found these at my Dollar Tree and I wanted to give these a try. I've tried other ones um, by this, Warheads. You know, they've got the super sour candy. They also had one that was called um, Hot Heads and it was like squiggly worms. <laughs> or crawlers or whatever they want to call them. Those weren't all that hot, but I thought I'd give these a try because, I don't know, I saw them and this is um, supposed to be super hot. And it says from, from the makers of Warheads, called Hot Heads, Scorching Heat Twists. There we go, guys, Hot Heads. <laughs> and then guys, one up. And it's the Molten Mango Piping Hot Pineapple and Atomic Green Apple. Sour Sweet with Heat Inside. S filled Center. Chewy Candy. So there you go. And it says on the back, it says, Scorching Heat. If you love Warheads, then you're going to go crazy for their new Alter Ego Hot Heads. Test your taste buds with Scorching Heat Twists. Okay, and for... Six pieces, 110 calories. And there you go. And well, let's find out. There's only three flavors. Mango, pineapple, and atomic green apple. Here we go, guys. Hopefully they're not too terribly hot. I know the warheads, the hot head, the other squiggly ones were supposed to be super hot. I tried those a while back. They weren't that hot. When I think, you know, super intense hot is going to be like, you know, blow your mouth off because like the super sour, you can't hardly sit there and, um, you know, eat those uh, things when it's like super duper sour, concentrated until it gets the um, outside of that. Uh... Okay, you know, there we go. All right. Wow. I can really smell that um, intenseness on there. Okay. And that one looks like a mango. Wow, I could really smell them. Damn, it's like concentrated sour. So, <clears throat> this I believe is the pineapple. This is the green apple. And I believe this one is the mango. So you got mango, pineapple, and green apple. All three flavors. And there's a, a pretty good amount in here. Maybe you not gonna be able to see it but uh four ounce bag so a couple of them and here we go i'm gonna try them and see if i can survive <laughs> this one i believe is going to be mango mango molten mango and you can see that uh, it's got that filling in the middle it's kind of like a licorice tube i guess twist heat twist there we go Hmm. Okay. More sour than hot. I'm not getting the heat yet. Mango. Hmm. Okay, the center. Okay. Oh, wow. <clears throat> wow, it's a mango. Wow. Mmm. <laughs> when you get to that center, it's got, it's 
It's got a kick, man. Wow. It's very concentrated. It's like eating, it is like eating a hot pepper. <laughs> Ooh. I'm, it wasn't like extremely hot, like where you don't melt your face off, but it does have some heat to it. I'm trying to see if there's any, what the sunflower oil does not say what uh, the heat is in there. doesn't say like anything like habanero or ghost pepper extract or oil or whatever okay this one is the pineapple first one was mango a little bit chewy a little bit of sour on the outside okay that's pineapple when you get to the middle and you start chewing that center, it hits you. Hmm. Okay. Oh, wait, there we go. A little bit of that. Hmm. Concentrated center. Mm-hmm. I don't taste like a lot of pineapple on that one. But I am getting heat. <coughs> That's like eating a hot pepper. Get a little bit of that pineapple afterwards. Once you get to the middle and you kind of get that little heat, it's kind of a residual burn. Okay, lastly is green, sour green apple. Atomic green apple. Okay. Pipe and pineapple was the other one. Holton mango. All right. Atomic green apple. Hmm. Okay, I'm tasting the green apple. And that. Hmm. Center's not as hot on that one. There's still heat. Hmm. Nice little bit of kick on that one, on the finish. It kind of like hits the back of your throat. I am getting a little bit of a burning in the back of my throat. These are a little bit, a little bit spicy. Um, if you're not um, able to tolerate the heat, I'd say no. Just pass them by. Don't try them. They are pretty good. I like the flavors. A little bit of the kick from that um, center. So, hmm. Not bad, guys. So for the Warheads Hothead Scorching Heat Twists, that is pretty good. I like the candy. I like that little heat, little burn, slow residual burning on that one. It's not bad. So for this one, uh, I have to give that a nine, nine out of eleven. It's good, good candy, good amount of heat. The flavors came through pretty good on the what they were. The pineapple, the the green apple, and the mango. I could really taste the mango a little bit more. I think I liked the mango the best, then the apple, then the pineapple. I couldn't really taste much on the pineapple, so they were good flavors. They did have a little bit of that heat in there. So if you have them at your Dollar Tree and you like a little bit of spicy candy, stuff like that, give them a try. Go on down and see if you like them. So that's my take on the Hot Heads from the makers of Warheads. If you, if you like the hot stuff, give it a try. So, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the subscribe and the notification bell right over there. That way you won't miss any future content, or if I go live, you won't miss the fun. 
So until next time on Drew's Food Reviews, when I will be trying something new and hot for you, I'm going to put these aside because I'm still getting a little bit of the burn and um, hopefully I'll give them a try a little bit later. So until next time on Drew's Food Reviews, talk to you guys later. Cut, take two. And it says from the makers of War Hut with <laughs> from the <laughs> Take two, start over. This is from the